Welcome to the Hayden and Son festive quiz. Uh, I hope in the next coming slides you'll find the questions quite fun um, and it's an opportunity for you to sit at home and write down the questions and then write down the answers or just write down the answers, whichever you wish. Um, so we're going to start with the first question then. And the first question is, how many ghosts show up in a Christmas carol? So that's the film. How many ghosts show up in a Christmas carol? And the answer is four ghosts turn up. Uh, that's Marley, that's the ghost of Christmas past, the ghost of Christmas present, and the ghost of things to come. That's four ghosts that turn up. So, next question, question two. What are the two other most popular names for Santa Claus? What are the mo what are the two other most popular names for Santa Claus? And the answer is Chris Kringle and Saint Nick. So Chris Kringle and Saint Nick. Question three then. In the movie, It's a Wonderful Life, what happened every time a bell rang? So in the movie, It's a Wonderful Life, what happened every time a bell rang? <laughs> And the answer is an angel gets his wings. So it's an angel gets his wings. Question four. In Charles Dickens, A Christmas Carol, what was the first name of Scrooge? So in the Charles Dickens, A Christmas Carol, what was the first name of Scrooge? <laughs> And the answer is Ebenezer, so it's Ebenezer Scrooge. Okay, and question five. Which fairy tale was the first gingerbread houses inspired by? Which fairy tale was the first gingerbread houses inspired by? <laughs> And the answer is Hansel and Gretel. So Hansel and Gretel um, is the answer to that one. Now question six. Well, what is the best-selling Christmas song yeah. ever? So what is the best-selling Christmas song ever? <laughs> And the answer is White Christmas by Bing Crosby. That's White Christmas by Bing Crosby. It's question seven then. Three of Santa's reindeers' names begin with the letter D. What are those names? Three of the Santa's reindeers' names begin with the letter D. What are those names? And the answers are Dancer, Dasher and Donna. So it's Dancer, Dasher and Donna. Question eight. What was the first company that used Santa Claus in advertising? What was the first question, uh, where, first company that used Santa Claus in advertising? <laughs> And the answer is Coca-Cola. So Coca-Cola was the uh, first company. Question nine. In the Christmas song, who did the narrator sing 
kissing Santa Claus under the mistletoe. So in the Christmas song, who did the narrator see kissing Santa Claus under the mistletoe? <laughs> And the answer is mummy. Mummy was seen under the mistletoe. So question 10. What Christmas decoration was originally made from the strands of silver? So what Christmas decorations were originally made from strands of silver? <laughs> And the answer is tinsel. Tinsel was the uh, decoration. So question 11. Who played George Bailey in the classic film, It's a Wonderful Life? Who played George Bailey in the Christmas classic, It's a Wonderful Life? <laughs> And the answer, Jimmy Stewart. So Jimmy Stewart was uh, the person you were looking for. So question 12. What Christmas beverage is also known as milk punch? What Christmas beverage is also known as milk punch? <laughs> And the answer, eggnog. Eggnog is the answer. So question 13, what Christmas themed ballet premiered in St. Petersburg, Russia in 1892? So that's what Christmas themed ballet premiered in St. Petersburg, Russia in 1892? <laughs> And the answer, the nutcracker. So the nutcracker is your answer to that question. And question 14, which Hollywood actor played six different roles in the Polar Express? So which Hollywood actor played six different roles in the Polar Express? <laughs> And the answer is Tom Hanks. So Tom Hanks managed to play six different people within the Polar Express. Far cleverer than I would ever be. Uh, so question 15. What holiday movie sequel includes a cameo by Donald Trump? So what holiday movie sequel includes a cameo by Donald Trump, um, President of the United States of America? <laughs> And the answer, Home Alone 2, where he appears in the hotel foyer for about 20 seconds. So question 16, which country did Eggnog come from? So which country did Eggnog come from? <laughs> And the answer is England. So England is the answer to question 16. So question 17, uh, which real life person in Santa Claus is based on? Which real person is Santa Claus based on? And the answer to question 17 is the okay. Christian Bishop St. Nicholas. Oh, okay. So the Christian yeah. Bishop St. Nicholas is the answer to question 17. Question 18. What are you supposed to do when you find yourself under mistletoe? What are you supposed to do when you'll find yourself under mistletoe? <laughs> And 
And the answer is, have a little kiss. So have a little kiss is the answer to question 18. And two more to go, question 19. According to the song, what did my true love give to me on the eighth day of Christmas? So according to the song, what did my true love give to me on the eighth day of Christmas? <laughs> And the answer to that question 19 is eight maids a milking. So it's eight maids a milking is the answer to question 19. And now the last question in today's uh, festive quiz, which is Elvis isn't going to have a white Christmas. He's going to have a what? Elvis is going to have a what? Isn't going to have a white Christmas. He's going to have a what? <laughs> And for those Elvis fans out there who know Elvis songs really well, you'll know he's going to have a blue Christmas. Yep, he's going to have a blue Christmas. So as uh, we do the last question there, we would like to wish you all the very best for the festive period from everyone here at Hayden and Son in the coming uh, days ahead. So wishing you a very, very happy Christmas and a very, very, very happy new year. Thank you for joining us today. <laughs>